What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. Today I want to talk about the new calendar and the old calendar. If you click, or if you're not seeing this, just click on settings and then choose calendar type, embedded calendar, that's the old calendar, and type web calendar, that's the new calendar. Um, can you use both? Yes. Can you switch anytime? Yes. Um, this one we've been working on it like this one actually is what two two weeks old the other one is about four years old so we're still working on it as of today if you're up to date yes it is functional and it does have uh, all the feature the old calendar have and more up top you can search by name and by cell phone the other one could only search by cell phone this, this has two options all your notifications up top right here will be here um, it will be listed the new, uh, co when, when customers request an appointment, it will be listed right here. This will light up uh, and uh, you can request info right there. Somebody's information by phone number, um, it's right there. Uh, change of view, I mean, that, that's, the, that's the cool thing about it. Let me just put myself aside. Uh, you can switch it to month view, which is kind of cool because why I like this, if I want to go to April and then make an appointment from here, on let's say on Saturday, let's say alignment and uh, mark, and I can select the customer, select the car. I can type the customer request because uh, if you want to type more than just alignment, if he needs more, you can type it right here. Uh, you can switch that and say two hours um, and click add. You can confirm it to confirm text message and then send. So all at once, like doing the whole thing at once, creating an appointment, confirming it, and we already put it on Saturday uh, on April. So, but most people are gonna be using obviously the week view. Um, uh, so yeah, so you're gonna be using mostly the week view more than anything. So what's the difference again with the new calendar and old calendar? Let me summarize. You still can use the old calendar. You don't have to switch to the new calendar because they, they use the same database. So it doesn't matter. You can switch next year. You can switch tomorrow. You can switch right now. Uh, primarily the looks, uh, we had to, I had to redesign this completely uh, to make sure it fits. Uh, customer don't want to scroll. I was like, well, you know, <laughs> literally. Our customers, VIP customers, don't scroll versus uh, Shop Monkey and Techmetric. They scroll all day, and I, I get it. We, the first version of this calendar was, you know, you were scrolling, and it was so hard because the moment you scroll, uh, you don't know what's going on at 7 a.m. So uh, yes, I agree with my customers. You got to be able to see from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Um, uh, uh, for, in, what, without scrolling, that way you know what's going on. Uh, keep in mind you can always come in here and change the, the hours um, if if you have more than seven more than like if you if you're 24 hours then you can you can make it 24 hours but other than that then leave this look because this is the best look that you're gonna see even if you're not using 7 p.m uh, just leave it because you never know when you need to use it just put something right there just for reminder so keep that in mind um, uh, the last thing I want to say is this calendar looks better than shop monkey calendar and tech metric calendar and if you say if you think otherwise prove it thanks for watching